The world does not need leaders. In fact, what we need is inspiration. Now, inspiration, the word, the etymology of inspiration to inspire means to breathe into, to inflame. Actually, it's referring to creation or, or divinity. So, we all have the divine spark within us. We are a part of nature, of creation, of the divine. We are not separate from, from it, from the system of nature. So we have the ability to inspire others. And this is what we need to understand and activate. Anyone knows that when you're trying to bring important information to people, uh, it cannot be forced upon anyone, right? This is why we need inspiration, because inspiration speaks to the heart space. The heart is the pump. It pumps the blood, the life force. It's the generator. The genitive principle is the heart. This is what creates care and action. This is why art is so impactful, because it inspires on many levels. So it's important that we understand to get to a level of inspiration or inspiring, we need to create art, right? The process of art itself is inspiring. And we can put, we can use technology to put the artifacts into reality, right? Anyone can view them later on at any time period and feel that inspiration and our goal is to inspire people to activate within themselves to take a deeper look <clears throat> this is what true education is education means to lead one out of darkness the darkness of ignorance and it's always about action Right? So when we inspire others and it speaks to the heart, activates care, and then we use the mind to look deep within and then activate. So, my friends, when you discover your soul purpose, what you are here to do to accomplish and learn your Dharma, right? We need to activate that within us with the message of freedom, truth, nature, morality. This is true empowerment. And we get there by inspiring others, not forcing it down their throat or trying to force them to, um, to have self-realization. We inspire them to do the work on their own and self-actualize. Have a good day.